So how are you guys doing this morning? Are you doing good? Did you see that song that we just sang before the prayer time? You guys know that song, Jesus Loves Me? Do you believe that song? Yeah, that's good. Because a lot of people sometimes don't. Did you know that? I don't know, it's kind of hard to believe, right? Because that's what we always talk about, that Jesus loves me. But sometimes people get worried that they've messed up so bad. I mean, I don't know about you guys, but when I was your age, I used to mess up all the time. Do you guys, you guys ever get in trouble? Timeouts, grounded, stuff taken away. But does your mom and dad still love you? What, see, we have that example. Our moms and dads still love us, even when we mess up really bad. And yet sometimes we think, well, if I mess up so bad, Jesus won't love me. Well, duh. If our parents can love us, and they're just human, like us, Jesus must love us even better. In fact, the Bible even tells us that. Jesus told his disciples that, you know, our parents are good to us and give us good gifts. They don't even give us, and even if they give us bad gifts, God will give us even better stuff because God loves us so much. So I want you to hear this morning that even though you may mess up and sometimes you may get in a lot of trouble and as you grow older, you may feel like you get in even more trouble or, or, or slide to a place that you know, even God can't love you. But I want you to know, I want you to think of that song, Jesus Loves Me, this I know, but the Bible tells me so, because that's it. Jesus will never, ever Stop loving you. Period. There's no ifs, ands, or buts. It's just period. Jesus loves you. Period. I preached on that once before, didn't I? Yeah. Um, so remember that because Jesus always claims you, always wants you, always likes having you here no matter what you've done and no matter what you look like, no matter how many Tootsie Rolls you take. <laughs> Even when I say two and you take more, Jesus still loves you. I still love you, the congregation still loves you, and we want to have you here learning and loving, right? All right, let's pray. Dear Jesus, Dear Jesus thank, you thank you for loving us. We're sorry we mess up, we mess up. but we're so glad that we are always welcome in your house and that we know that you love us. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Amen.